Welcome back to the Tech Shack to another low quality video. If it sounds like I'm exhausted, that's because I am. It is almost 1 a.m. All right, but I had to work my other gig where I produce a podcast um, every Wednesday over on their Rumble channel. So I went and produced their podcast. Um, but right before I left, the UPS man showed up with these new drives. And now that I'm back in the shack, I wanted to get these in the server and start getting the data transferred back to them. Now, if you saw my video on my drive failure, I had two four terabyte drives um, that I had actually three total um, in RAID 5, but two out of the three failed. So now we're going to run two eight terabytes in a RAID 1. I got these um, Ultrastar eight terabyte helium filled drives for about $109 a piece from Go Hard Drives. Now, I absolutely love Go Hard Drives. I have bought them from other sellers like Server Part Deals and a few others, but Go Hard Drives has an awesome warranty. They always stand behind their warranty. Some stuff only has a year, but these drives in particular have a five year warranty, and I know from experience that they stand behind their warranty and will swap out any drives that fail in that warranty. In fact, they've swapped some out. Um, for a colleague of mine that were actually four months outside of the warranty, but they still swapped them out anyway. All right, so Go Hard Drives is a phenomenal company. All right, great pricing. I highly recommend um, that company. And I ordered these drives on Monday. They shipped 6 p.m. Monday. They arrived by 6 p.m. on Wednesday. I did pay the $20 for the two-day air, but I wanted to get these drives in this week. And it was well worth it for the extra 20 bucks in shipping. Again, great warranty, great company to deal with. And I paid full price for these drives. This isn't sponsored or anything. Um, so this video is not sponsored by them. So if anything, it's sponsored by me. So go to jordoshack.tech. Check out the new site, the new domain. And check out the link to the Discord. Come and join the Discord. So let's get the green machine up on the bench and get these new drives in it. So everything is all in, all the data is transferred back. As you saw, the drives performed pretty well in uh, RAID 1. That is why I went with used Enterprise um, drives versus new like 5400 RPM Seagate drives I could have gotten for, could have gotten the new um, 5400 RPM drives for actually just a little bit more than I paid for these used drives. But these used drives from Go Hard Drive perform way better and they have a five year warranty um, from go hard drives and go hard drive stand behind their warranty So if there's ever an issue with these drives, which I doubt I can swap out under warranty the other drives I had that failed weren't go hard drives. I think I said that earlier weren't from go hard drives Those are from like worldwide distributor or something on Amazon This is the first time I've ever had to replace a drive in my server Because it it failed not because I outgrew the space um, But I'm already 40% full so I will probably need to expand soon but these drives are performing great. The warranty is great. Um, got another video coming up where we're gonna set up another mirror in the house, kind of an offsite backup with sync thing so we can get my sync thing back up because that is what saved me this time around why I didn't lose any data. All right, so next video, we're gonna do sync thing. I also have a video coming out. I don't know which order it's gonna come in where we do Jeffy's server in an old Alienware case. So have a look out for that video. 
But that is it for this low quality video. I will see you guys in the next one.